Welcome back for another episode of Why Not Wednesday. We've got two out-of-towners, not really because they're both from Omaha, kind of. Colleen is here from Michigan, and Sheila stopped by on her way back Hello. from Memphis. You live here, right? Correct, so in Bellevue. You're in the in-between. And aren't you glad you came back to this I lovely am. weather? But there's no snow. <laughs> there's so. no snow, and that's what I said. Better the than snow last better time. be gone. Oh, you know. had to drive through the flood last time, right? I had to drive around the flood. Yeah. When I came that home. That was not fun. No. So we let <laughs> Sheila choose this time. Um, and she's a sweet, white kind of gal. Uh, and so she chose my personal favorite from Trader Joe's. There's a lot of Trader Joe's talk <laughs> on the show lately. I go there twice a week. Um, they normally only have this in the holidays, but they had one bottle left, so I stole it. And this is the one she chose. I paid for it. I did not steal it. Um, it is an almond flavored sparkling wine that is made in Cirrus, California. I said that wrong. And we are going to drink it and chat with Sheila about travel nursing. So let's just cheers. Do you guys want to do the S's? Yep. You do? Okay. Smell. Smells, Smells good. Smells almondy. Nice. And then we're going to mm -hmm. swirl. It's got some legs. It does. It is leggier than I thought. It's 11% alcohol, so it has some alcohol to it. And it looks like... It's clear. Yeah. It's pretty clear. And now let's taste it. Yes. Do you like it? Almond. Do you like it? Yeah. Scale of one to ten, how much do you like it? <laughs> well, it, it doesn't compare to my blackberry from Tennessee. Mm. But that would be delicious if this were blackberry. Yeah, it would. You have a blackberry sparkling? Or is it not sparkling? I can make it sparkle. Okay. <laughs> Just throw some glitter in there. But <laughs> ciao! Or, you know, by the time I finish the bottle, it's pretty sparkly anyway. I don't know, I'd give it about... A it's a little dry. It's not as sweet as I remember no. it, but normally when I drink this, I drink a lot of it. So maybe yeah. that's why maybe that's is why. Foggy. Yeah. Well, no, and but for it's people good. who drink dry wine normally, this is probably really sweet it to is. them. It is. Yeah. This is uh, sweet to me, but not sweet yeah. to you. Do you and like I it, am Colleen? Sweet, sweet. Me too. Yeah, I you like guys it. Are just I both so sweet. Yeah. It's uh, the more sugar, the better, which is. My friends all make fun but of me. They like, they're like, like, you don't like real wine. You like sugar water. Wine. It's yeah. seven bucks. I'm just, no, Trader Joe's mean. should really just hire me yeah. to be their spokesperson. <laughs> and like Easter, New Year's, Christmas, Thanksgiving, boom, boom, boom. Perfect. It would go good with your dessert. Mm hmm. Yeah. How many wineries did you go to in Tennessee? There's no judgment free zone, Sheila. <laughs> judgment free zone. Because I'm your Facebook friend, so I can guess. Um, yeah. <laughs> Kind of a dead giveaway. Um, I went to Delta Blues, and that was in Arlington, Tennessee, which is right outside of Perfect. Uh, Memphis. Um, Millington, Old Millington, that is my favorite. That's your favorite? Is that where the plum and the blackberry are from? Yes. Okay. I can't remember the name of the other one. It wasn't that impressive. Oh. So, but I did only do three, but then I went to a, one in Arkansas. Oh. Not too far. No, and that one was Alta, Altum, something, some little town there. It's a cute little winery. Did you send us wine from there? That one. That one. That's and another one. one. Yes. Yeah. Yes. The, the cute little parachute one? Yes. Yeah, okay. Because that was sounding familiar. I'd researched yeah. that a bit. But uh, still, overall, my favorite winery I've ever been to is that castle in, in uh, California. In California. There's a lot of people that have been to. I have a nurse. She just went there this week. It's great. She it's, said it's beautiful. It is so. I pretty. think it would be worth the tour. Did you do the tour? Oh, I've done the tour three times. Do they take Even you though to I the don't dungeons? need. Oh yeah, they take you to the torture chamber. <laughs> they said at Halloween they have. Um, it's like a VIP party. You have to pay mega bucks to get to it, but it's like all costumed. House? Yeah, oh, and they open up the torture yeah. chamber and the dungeon, and it's pretty cool. I like it personally. I can see it is a little dry. It's maybe not as sweet. But it's still good. I mean, yeah. I, yeah. I'm not like, where's the spittoon and spitting it out, you know, like <laughs> no. you do at some wineries. That would say. be wasteful. That would be. And I silently just, judge the people who spit out their wine, even I just, if they're professionals. I try not to do that. No, what's the point in drinking it? I don't want to just taste it. I want to feel it. <laughs> 
Have you been to a winery on every assignment? Yes. No. I've never because been when I first started traveling, I was too afraid to go out and venture out. But now. So that, yeah. So those those first couple you didn't. Right. It does take a while, I think, to get comfortable just saying. Well, the first it. assignment I had was in St. Thomas for six months. Okay. Do they even have wineries? They don't have there? wineries. They have like They've got rummeries. rummeries. Is that a word? I no, I but it, it up. Okay. Yeah. They should call it that. The story. rummery yeah. is on St. Croix, which I did my third assignment on. How far are the two cool apart? Places. About 40 miles by boat. So that's a decent trip. You'd have to take a really fast well, boat. Well, they used to have a ferry that would ferry you from St. Croix to St. Thomas. But still, Thomas. that would take... It took, I don't know, the ferry day? was, I didn't care about St. Croix when I was on St. Thomas, because I didn't know anything about St. Croix. I, I mean, just cared I about St. John. Here, I got, okay, so maybe like two hour ferry. That's not bad. Probably, no. Yeah. And then when I was in Puerto Stay Rico, I went to some, oh my gosh, I should know this, there. whiskey <laughs> place. <clears throat> it wasn't whiskey, I don't know what it was, I went to some alcoholic place. Puerto Rico. I like whiskey. They don't drink rum there? They, there was some big factory I went to. I can't remember what it was. Hmm. I should know because it was, it's a popular brand. But well, that means that their, whatever they were serving no, was pretty good. It was good. pretty good. I don't remember it. <laughs> well, Sheila, it's been a delight having yes, you. Yes, thank you. We're going to drink the rest of this off camera. Okay. And we're not saving any for you, <laughs> Rachel. Thank you. See you next week. <laughs>